you, know, you also played with uh, Luis Figo later uh, you coincided with him at uh, Barcelona how did you react with his transfer to Real Madrid it felt like the end of the world for the for the coolies. well Luis Figo is a player we are all players uh, our job is today you are here tomorrow you are somewhere else so the the reality is that uh, he's having a professional mind and uh, remaining positive uh, before Luis Figo came to Barcelona, he was playing in somewhere else. So uh, when he left uh, Sporting, also the people in Sporting could have felt that that's the end of Sporting. So I think uh, <laughs> the important thing is that uh, we have to respect his decisions. Uh, football is crazy. Today you might be the king, tomorrow the club might not want you. So uh, we respect people's and the club uh, opinion. The important thing is that uh, you have been able to, to give the best you can. Would you have played for El Ahli, for example? If Ali have approached me before Zamalek, why not? Why and after? <laughs> and after? What? If, Zamalek, if Zamalek does not want me when I was there and Ali want me, there is nothing wrong in playing for the Ali. Ali, they are not our... Uh, they are not my enemy, they are not uh, uh, this team. I'm a, Zamal I'm a Zamalek player and I'm happy that uh, my playing days I was able to you know, contribute uh, to the success of the team uh, when I was there. So even Ali, uh, in as much as, uh, okay, we are rival, rivalry in terms of one another, but of course also when they are playing, they are representing Egypt. Uh, when Zamalek is playing, they are representing Egypt. Uh, you have seen a lot of players move from Zamalek to Ali, Ali to Zamalek. So it wasn't a new thing. Football is changing and uh, people mindset are changing. Uh, if you, are, you can be in Ali, you are not having enough game a time. Uh, maybe Zamalek can say, okay, let's take him. If, if the opportunity is there, why not? Why can't you go and play for Zamalek? He can also be in Zamalek. Uh, maybe you are not having enough time, you want to go and some Ali, Ali can say, come and play for us, why not? So, you know, it's just uh, the world are globalizing, people are, uh, you know, are changing, people are adapting. But the important thing is the respect. You must learn to respect everybody. Uh, Ali, they are good size. Amalek is a good team also with a lot of history. So, uh, the Egyptians, they are even, they, I could say they are lucky that uh, they have two big teams. Uh, that are doing very well when it comes to continental games that have represented Egypt in, in African level that um, many players have you know, come out from Zamalek Canale to represent the national team and they have done so well. So I think it's something to be proud of. It's not something uh, to be dragging about uh, competition between one another. Yeah, uh, we players uh, we have respect for ourselves. We might be enemy on the field, but after the game, when we see each other on the street, we're always greeting each other and hugging each other. Yeah. I know you struggled to adapt to Zamalek. Uh, you were basically a teenager when you arrived. Well, it's a normal thing. When you come to a place new, you, you, it takes time a little bit uh, with the change of culture, uh, change of lifestyle, change of everything. Uh, so it takes time. But I don't think I, I struggle to adapt. No, uh, I did struggle. I took my time. Uh, I was training extraly uh, to prepare myself because I came when the league already have started. And I arrived on, uh, if I'm not mistaken, I arrived on Tuesday and then on Friday I played the game. So there was no much time to uh, to you know have that chemistry with my teammates uh, there was no much time to train to to be fit but you know as the league progresses i was able to to establish myself well i spent most of the time i think with nabi mahmoud uh, i spent most of the time and uh, he is the one i go with when we are going to the camp uh, he carries me in his car but i for me, it's not about the best teammate. Uh, all my teammates in Zamalek at that particular time, I have a very good relationship with them. 
uh, Hussein, I don't, I forget his son name that play right fullback. He was my neighbor in the building we were living. So I have a very good relationship with Shamiaka, the captain, uh, was a very good friend. Uh, Ashraf Kasim, Jimmy, uh, Red Abdullah, uh, Shishini, uh, Khaled Gandu, many, most all the players, you know, I have a very good relationship with them. So for me, they are all important to me. and. Uh, I thank them a lot, you know, for their support and uh, for bringing me into the team, for helping me, uh, for believing in me also. And uh, with this, we were able, you know, uh, to achieve all we achieved during uh, the time I was there.